Good Saturday morning, everybody. Or actually, it's Friday. It's Friday morning. It messed me up because, you know, today is uh, Black Friday, but it's the day of the hog game up in Columbia. Um, we, the way it was weird because the way it worked out when they started playing Missouri on that last Friday, or the Friday for Thanksgiving, uh, we had started, come, we alternated between my parents and Brittany's parents on like Christmas and Thanksgiving. So this year, Thanksgiving's here and Christmas is at um, mine. No, I don't have your phone. She always loses her phone. She'll take it and forget it. And ever since she's, she used to be like super, like remembers everything and picks and very picky and has like, okay, I got five things, one, two, three, and try to remember it all. And after she had Xander, it's kind of just, she just doesn't care as much anymore or just loses it. And I don't know. But we go to the Missouri game because it's a hundred, like not a hundred miles, about an hour up the road from where Brittany's parents live. So we go to that, which is, it's neat going to the game. The stadium's not great. That it looks great. And the seats are fine, but there's only one level for, like, concession stand and bathrooms. And so, like, everybody's there at halftime, and it's horrible. But we're going to go up early and eat Shakespeare's Pizza and then walk around and hopefully not have to pay for parking and get out of there quick after the game. We made it up to Columbia and parked in, a like, a school parking. Like, there's a residence. Hold on. Maybe a little better. So hopefully we don't get the ticket, but I don't think we will. Um, but now we're just gonna walk to get some food, and then we're gonna walk to oh, oh. the game. And it's supposed to be like 50 degrees, 52 at kickoff. But it's like 42 right now, because it's still super cloudy, and we're ready for the sun to come out. So we ate at Shakespeare's and it was pretty good. I mean, it was great, but it was good. Uh, we'll, we'll definitely go back. Um, and now we've got about uh, got about two hours for kickoff. So I think we're just gonna walk through campus and see how different theirs is from the U of A and see which one we like better. Our, our initial thought is that we like U of A way better because it's really- It's less industrial. It's, it's, yeah, U of A is less industrial. This is very blocky and bricky and I don't know. We'll just have to walk around and see how much we like more. We got the thing was we get we wanted to get the Shakespeare's early because last time we went it was packed and it was like an hour and a half wait and we couldn't do it and so we wanted to get there early. Well, we got there early this time and now now we're at the game an hour and a half early, which isn't horrible. I mean they're letting people in, but we may just walk around and look at the stadium a little bit. It's not as big as U of A. But definitely, it's it's not a it's not a good SEC stadium, but it's it'll be, it'll get there. We sat right here, like right here. Well, that's where we sat. We sat right in here. Cause that's where that, that's where we're walking at is up here. And they'll all be over here, and then our bench is here, so we'll be right there. game like basically field level yeah, it's not the same size as uh any close to Arkansas and I don't know they said they're planning to expand but I mean it's just you can't hold a ton um, which it's not bad like, we like the stadium maybe this is the second game we've been here the bad part is whenever you get down to do like the concession stand or bathrooms, there's only one level, and that's where everybody has to go. So at U of A, there's 
know, there's at least two levels and then you have all that end zone where you can go get food. Well, this is only one level where everybody's gotta go get food at. And that starts to suck because everybody's trying to pee and go there and it does not, not work out. So, about an hour and a half to kick off. Uh, just gonna walk around, hang out, may go find Jack Ryan, Porter. He's in the band, we may see him and then uh, just chill out. So we got to our seats and they're actually a lot closer than they were last year, or like two years ago. We're on row 19, but they start at like 11 because that the end zones are a little different. So we're like only seven rows back, which is pretty awesome. All right, Britt? Woohoo! Hope they get a win. Well, they got up, we were up 20, 24 to seven? Yeah. 24 to seven at the end of the first half, and then we lost, <laughs> 28 to 24, we didn't score again. So now, <laughs> it was horrible. I mean, I don't, I don't, know, I don't, I don't even know what to say. I'm, I'm a loss for words of how bad the Hogs lost and how bad it was. But uh, it doesn't surprise me, that's how we play. Probably get a crappy bowl now. But if it's Liberty Bowl, we may go again. <laughs> because it's close and it's easy to go to. But uh, other than that, I don't know. Now we're walking back to the car and going back to Brittany's parents' house and then uh, go to Mexican or go get something to eat because we're hungry. You hungry? Yes. Yeah, so at least that's the one positive we have at the end of this is we still get to go get something to eat. So uh, this will be the end of the crappy end of the vlog today. So we will see you tomorrow. We're going straight or turn? Straight. Love you. We're gone. So we got bored and decided to come out on Black Friday, or Thursday night, I guess, to Walmart. It's really not that bad, but you know, all the good stuff don't start till like early, early in my morning. So we'll have to wait and see if there's anything worth getting here at all, or we're just wasting time, which either way, I'm kind of glad we're getting out because I was getting kind of cooped up, not doing anything outside.